guess. Something to show you. Am I gonna like it? I'm gonna say 30 to 1 odds against. Then I guess I better get it out the way. See you soon. Nudon wants to step into the ring with us. They got our recruitment video killed on all the big social media sites and threatened to sue anyone who hosts it. This is gonna cost us a lot of followers. DMCA takedown, annoying. This is worse than annoying. This is a declaration of war. I will not be censored. Hey, Nudon's a fucking scam. With rich people throwing away their money for some elitist circle jerk shit. This could be big for us. I mean, nobody's gonna take the side of those assholes unless they're already members. We are so gonna cornhole this fake-ass church. What's cornhole? Where the corn goes after you eat the corn, Josh. Oh. They don't like us using footage of their celebrity whore, Jimmy Siska. So let's start with him. He's our highest-profile spokesperson. But it's, it's Jimmy Siska. I mean... When I was a kid, I had the Siska glasses, the pop collar. I, I even knew every line to open wounds. Dude, me too. I even have the lunchbox. Nice. That's mint condition. Nice. Just not, not Siska, okay? Just anyone but him. There's, Please. there's gotta be another way, all right? I don't know. I was just thinking maybe we could talk to him. Fuck up his relationship with New Dawn. Back to wearing my Cisco tees without feeling like one. Wait a minute. You use cornhole as a verb. That doesn't even make sense in the context of you. Okay, okay. We focus on Cisco. <laughs> New Dawn keeps blackmail records of their celebrity shills, right? We check out the local center. We just need to get in and dig up his file. Everybody in? In. I'll round up the locals and I'll meet you there. Let the cornholing begin. Hey, <laughs> you heard the man. <laughs> Cornhole. <laughs> For too long, predators have victimized the weak and the wounded under the guise of religion. The Church of the New Dawn is a scam. Yeah. Rank in the church is based on financial contribution. Loyalty is bought through blackmail and fear. They believe they are untouchable. That will soon change. DeadSec will reveal the secrets and true purpose of New Dawn. You can help. Take up a mask and protest your local recruitment center. Let their leaders know what you think of them online. Join us as we send them a message. No more. DeadSec will give you the truth. Do what you will. Sorry. Don't! Move. Somebody help me! Nine one one, please state the nature of your emergency. Mama told me boys I'm chasing that bestang hoe Cause all 
Marcus, the followers just keep on coming. <laughs> That's gonna get a reaction from Bloom. I can't believe people let them grab so much power. All that sci-fi shit we read as kids. Big Brother, Thought Control, Pre-Crime. It's all here now, isn't it? Thanks to Bloom and their CTOS. Those authors saw it location. coming decades ago, but nobody listened. Everybody's too sold on pleasant corporate platitudes and flawless branding to realize the whole damn thing's a societal trojan. It doesn't help that CTOS actually does what they say it does, either. We're opposing a system that helps people on the surface, but exploits them behind the scenes. Makes it easy to paint us as the bad guys. Question for you. How much access does DedSec have to CTOS? In other cities, when it was still CTOS 1.0, we had a lot. Sucks because we were too careless. Missed our window to do something big. In 2.0, we're the first group to go up against it. So we're still playing catch up. They were expecting us this time. Yeah, the thought of dead sec written on a whiteboard in some bloom office makes me all squishy inside. We keep it up. Next time, maybe they'll use the red marker. <sighs> Distracting enough for you? You gonna go inside and take a peek, or...? Oh, yeah. Oh, and I wore my church clothes. Nice. Buy enlightenment! It only costs your life savings! Uh... All right, I'm heading in. I'll dig up what I can on Siska. We're about to go to battle with these f***s. We need to generate some serious outrage. Can't we just make something up? If we get caught lying, everything else DedSec ever claimed will be called a lie. Don't worry. If they've shit the bed, I'll find the dirty sheets. And in comes Marcus with the classy metaphor. <laughs> I aim to please.
Stay awake. Is this a real? Let's move! Check 
Guys, I think we can use Siska as an ally. The man's in big trouble with the church. They're even planning an emergency audit. Audit? They're after his money. Of course they are. But this is something different. They wire themselves up to these bullshit electronic doohickeys and play psychiatrists with each other. It's cute. Siska's waiting for the auditor to show, but he's gonna get me instead. Are you serious? You're gonna wing it. So gonna wing it. First, I have to delay the real auditor. He's gonna get a call from Jimmy Siska. Yes, guys, you have to hear his Jimmy Siska impression. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I don't have time now. I'll be in touch. Hey, that's me. Hello? Jason, I heard you're coming for an audit today. Jimmy, right, right. I was just about to leave. How's it going? Not good. I think I ate one too many empanadas, my friend. My stomach is way too unstable for a session, if you catch my drift. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I get you. Violent, violent diarrhea. Yes, I understand. Can we reschedule? Yeah, we're gonna have to. I took a handful of chewables. I'll give you a call back soon, I promise. We good? We're cool. You take care of yourself, Jimmy. Working on it. Yo, Sitar, I was curious about your posters. They're good. <laughs> Real good. Like art. <laughs> Fuck off. They are art. <laughs> I don't know, man. I've never done the street art thing before. You'll just have to be my student then. Sending you a meeting spot. See you there. If you think you can hack it. Hey, Ghoul, what's up? I managed to snatch some new Dawn clothes for you. Gotta look the part, right? <laughs> nice. Thanks, man. No worries. Give him hell. Yes? Hi. I'm Jason Lowell. Huh. I'm here for your audit. Okay, Jason Lowell. <laughs> I hear you're the best. Come on in. Thank you for the hospitality. Please. All right, uh, let's get started, huh? My sources tell me that you've been having some doubts about the church. I want you to tell me about that. <laughs> doubts? Well, doubts is a, it's a strong word. I'm not as inspired 
as I used to be. Jimmy, Jimmy, step up. Don't hide things from us. <sighs> You're right. Okay. Okay, there are rumors about this place where they take church members who are having issues, and they don't come back for a really long time, if they come back at all. I've heard these rumors, and guess what? They're just rumors. <laughs> but that's it? I'm not in trouble? For telling the truth? No. Thank you. I, I, I promise you will not regret this. Yeah, look, well, look, one last thing. I really need to get to the heart of this rumor, so do they say where this imaginary camp might be? I don't know. I don't know. I hope I never find out. Well, does it have a name? Ah, uh, the, the, the Red Room. They called it the Red Room. Oh, yeah, man. And one last thing, man. Like, your last five movies have been just disappointing as shit, so act better. All right, keep your chin up. Peace! Dude, you gotta try them out if you can catch your truck. Two words, Korean burrito. All right, I have a new lead on how we can burn New Dawn, but I'm missing a key piece. Jimmy Siska is afraid of something called the Red Room. Jimmy Siska in the Red Room. The Red Room seems to be some kind of rehab center where they send problematic church members. People who go there, sometimes they stay gone. If they're kidnapping people, this is potentially huge for us. This goes beyond my resources. Want me to reach out? Nah, I got this. Damn. Miranda speaking. Hi, it's me, Marcus. Marcus? All the way? How did you get my number? Right, I forgot. I need something. It's about New Dawn. Have you ever heard of the Red Room? Miranda? Texting you an address. Meet me there. I just need info. Uh -huh.
What kind of trouble are you in? We're making trouble for the church. We who? Dead sec. I knew it. I have friends that would love to put dead sec behind bars. Like a good fight? Hey, so did you. Excuse me? Oh, I watched you go toe to toe with New Dawn back in the day, but hey, I get it. You a councilwoman now. No, 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 no. You don't get to pull that I sold out crap on me. These assholes wreck lives on a weekly basis. They went public with videos of my surgeries. But here's the thing. I don't give a shit. I got nothing to hide. But you're right. I am a councilwoman now. My hands are tied. That's why you asked me to meet you here. You need my help. Looks like you need mine. Plus, I finished what I started. First of all, don't mistake New Dawn for a church. They are a criminal organization. I pulled the records of all the properties they own in the Bay Area. There's one that just doesn't check out. Over there. Hmm. They have it marked as an educational center. Doors are locked. Nobody answers. Security comes and goes. Does that sound like an education center to you? Nah, it sounds like a re-education center. I'll stick around. Go see what you can find. Thanks, Miranda. Marcus, did you meet with Miranda? I did. We think this is the place, but we don't know what kind of place this is. It's obvious they're hiding something, though. So, I'm gonna see if I can find a computer and snoop around.
Jimmy Siska. Looks like you were right. Hello, Marcus. This is the place, and they brought Jimmy Siska here. If I bust him out, think you can get him someplace safe? Count on it. I'll be ready. Jason! My name's not Jason, and I'm not with Nudon. I don't belong here, man. You gotta get me out. Get moving, go. Okay, okay. Miranda, Jimmy Siska's headed your way. What about you? I'll get out on my own. Just make sure he's safe. I will. I got Jimmy out safe. Thanks, Miranda. Hey, you did all the legwork. Here, he wants to talk to you. Marcus, if that's your name. I want to burn these bastards and I know where to start. I'll meet you outside the Temple of New Dawn. Man, you should file a police report. We just proved the church keeps prisoners. I've got footage. We'll release a video soon to let the world know. What else do we need? I can lead you to the heart of the religion. The holy relics. The original source. Now, how am I going to resist an offer like that? I'll see you there.
Marcus, our followers network is becoming a steamroller. <laughs> you should be proud. You started all of this. DeadSec was a bunch of loose ideas before, but you've turned it into a movement. People are wearing your art, repeating your slogans. You've tuned into something here. Thank you, Marcus. Just don't forget, there's purpose behind this. I'm not in it for the candy coating. I want people to wake the fuck up. Yeah, they've been sleeping a long time, but they'll get there. confidential emails has had unexpected consequences for HMP Studios. Contents of the documents expose an ongoing contentious collaboration with Galilei, the company responsible for the expensive high-tech car featured in the studio's latest blockbuster, CyberDriver. The emails reveal that a studio executive referred to the car as a useless lemon and threatened legal action against the space company. There was good news for HMP Studios, however. Following the hack, interest around the movie spiked, making CyberDriver the surprise hit of the year. Police say that the studio has yet to press charges against the hacker group. We'll keep you posted. Ow! Yeah! Looks like Galilei's keeping busy. Kid, yeah, it's me. I'm over here. Jimmy Siska. I'm in disguise. Yeah, I can see that. <sighs> Beautiful, isn't it? That house is built on lies, and it's time for, for a, a confession. confession. <laughs> <laughs> Man, open wounds three, that. That is a modern classic. Classic. I'm sorry, kid. I didn't I didn't know you were such a fan. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I fucked up, didn't I? Seems to be a running theme in that. There's always time for a fresh start, like right here. Right here and right now. Mm -hmm. You know, kid, maybe not right here and right now. I don't know if I can go back in there. Well, it's all good. Just tell me what to look for. I got you. Right. Uh, right. Okay. So uh, there's a lift that will take you down into the basement. In the basement, there's a room. Inside the room, there are ancient Sumerian tablets said to have been written by the visitor himself. No, hey, man, I'm serious. And they, they are deadly serious. Okay, man. Nah, I believe you. That's perfect. Okay. 
Look, if you need anything else, you let me know. Okay, gang, I'm about to sneak inside New Dawn's temple. And Jimmy's agreed to deliver a special message for our video. We're all set up once you raid the treasure. Watch out for snakes. There are always snakes. <laughs> it's not that kind of temple, right? What the fuck is a hacktivist? Anarchist, mostly. Some kind of script kiddies who want to play vigilante. Oh. Is that what's got everyone so riled up? I guess. All the execs and shareholders are concerned about us securing neighborhoods if things go sideways. What do they think this is? Satter City? Hey, I... I can't see the bay descending into madness ever, but if it did, what, you'd be prepared to conduct combat operations in Oakland or whatever? The essential American soul... Looks like you slipped by. Better call it in. Oh my god! Shutting down here. Verifying target. You're only making things worse. This trouble has come too long. Show no restraint. Look, we'll notify 
by the SFPD. They can handle it from here. Let's spread out. Come on. Fan out! Find him!
That's gotta be Jimmy's elevator. I've unlocked the secret lift. I can't believe you actually said that. What? It's true. Welcome to the fifth level of the New Dawn, and congratulations on your spiritual ascendance. Thank you. I worked hard for it. at New Dawn's prized possessions. The foundation of their entire religion. Rows of ancient Sumerian tablets. There's a lot of crazy shit in here, but this, no, this, this is something special. Why aren't they in a museum? I mean, what gives the church the right to keep these hidden away from us? Let's find out. Oh, it says do not touch, but I really want to touch. I mean, just a little. Come on. So much rich history. I mean, I am so glad to be a part of all the... Oh, no, 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 no! They're fucking fake. <laughs> this is all bullshit. People commit to New Dawn, pay millions of dollars before they get to see these, and they're fake. As fake as everything else the church promises. <clears throat> Yeah. Now I feel better. Let's go home. decided to dig into the church of the New Dawn and found crime and corruption at its core. They purchased large amounts of personal data to better target their enemies. They may already have a file on you. On you. We will proceed to leak everything we collected to our usual dispatches. Read them. Read them. Verify them. Verify. You will come to the same conclusion we did. New Dawn is a criminal organization designed to intimidate its own members into destroying their own lives and handing over their savings. Okay. But don't take our word for it. We have a celebrity guest. Yes. Hello, I'm Jimmy Siska. You probably remember me from a bunch of good movies I made before I was brainwashed by New Dawn and forced to toe the company line. When friends of mine questioned the church's cruel practices, they disappeared. When I questioned that, I was taken against my will and locked away. Know that the police are already investigating my claims. And what is the church all about? What's behind door number five? I'll let my friends in DeadSec demonstrate. DeadSec has given you the truth. God. Fucking welcome!
I give up. I'm just going to give up. What's wrong? I'm a student at Oakland Advanced Tech. We entered Noodle's e-card challenge, and we just keep losing. We can't seem to beat the fancy schools, especially Stanford. They're backed by big companies with all kinds of tech. We're just Oakland. It's hopeless. Hey, Oakland's got energy and grit. Oakland can get it done, man. I'm from Oakland. I like the way you think. You want to be our driver? You kidding? Somebody has to. Count me in. My name's Marcus. Good to meet you, Marcus. I'm Taylor. Good luck on the first race. Got it. the race that never happened before look if you get yourself a decent battery it would help a lot getting off the blocks yeah makes sense i'll see if i can find you one
the prep course. Man, fuck that noise. It's a drone race, man. Yeah, it's like, it's like, it's like NASCAR meets Star Wars. You strap on the drone and you drone camera. It's like you're flying, bro. And then you fly past yourself. The shit is tripping, baller. Come on. And then there's some, like, sweet prize money in the big event. And the world champion. Some wild bias and shit. Yeah, I bet they'll get a U.S. league pretty soon, though. Set. I got the battery. You're kidding. Bring it on by. Maybe it'll do some good.
Hey, Taylor, here's the battery. In the nick of time. We'll install it while you get ready to drive. Here we go. Got it. Let me go see if I can find you a velocity chip.
got it. Got it! Got it! Actually, if we could jack up the car's processor, we could improve its performance. Let me go see if I can find you a velocity check. has exposed New Dawn's religious secrets. DedSec revealed footage of New Dawn's temple area and demonstrated that the so-called ancient artifacts were simply fakes of what New Dawn claimed were ancient tablets. Members of the hacker group managed to infiltrate the highly guarded compound and capture the secretive organization's methods of control over members, including movie star Jimmy Siska. New Dawn declined our requests for an interview. Yo, Wrench. Yo, Em. Damn, man, I hope you kept the receipts. Hey, yo, check out this fuck stick. So tell us about Home 2.0. <laughs> Home systems are completely bulletproof. Your privacy is absolutely secure. Bold claim, Steven. Aren't you worried hacker groups will see that as a challenge? Well, say what you mean, Shirley. Dead sec. Now, if they want to go up against us, I invite them to try. <laughs> Home 2.0 is an OS with teeth. Yo, he called us out by name? Yep. He don't know who he fucking with. It's on now. Yeah, that's why I've been trying to crack 2.0. There's just one teeny little problem. What? Here. 
pull this. Stand back. Great. Chip! It's a little oh, hard to get out. Look, there's no point in trying to use the previous version's hardware to jack the new OS. Why? Because they changed the ports. Following the capital sky to forced obsolescence. But luckily, a little birdie told me that 2.0 should be packing a farm fresh zero day. Ooh, now that might just be a shame. Damn right. And that is why you, my friend, are going to hijack me a 2.0 pre-order shipment before some do-gooder white hat tells home how to cock block us. got a weird relationship with technology. You know that, right? 